Mounds of gravel two to three feet in diameter, up to a foot high, built by western harvester ants, are a conspicuous feature of rangeland in the high desert and grasslands of the western United States. Harvester ants clear the surrounding area of plants to prevent shade on their mound. Mounds may have more than one entrance, but the main entrance faces southwest. Use caution around the mound. These red ants not only bite, they inject a painful sting. Mature colonies consist of one queen, who may live up to 40 years, and 20,000 workers. Colonies may survive 20 years. The ant colony lives below the mound in a nest, which may be as deep as 16 feet. Beneath the mound, all female workers care for the queen and brood. Other workers excavate tunnels and chambers, maintain and protect the nest, and forage for seeds. Workers travel as far as 30 to 40 feet to gather pollen and seeds directly from plants, and to collect other seeds and dead insects on the ground, therefore acquiring their name Harvester. Workers create a scent trail using pheromones so they can find their way back to the colony. Harvester ants grind the seeds with their mandibles to make something similar to bread loaves, which are stored in chambers in the nest to provide food for the winter. In July and August, males and reproductive females swarm around the nest. After mating, males die and mated females or queens dig a small burrow several inches deep to begin laying eggs and establish a new colony. In the fall, as temperatures decrease, ant activity on top of the mound decreases. Ants plug entrances into the nest with gravel and soil. They remain deep within the nest in winter to await spring when the yearly cycle begins again.